What up everybody, welcome back. Today we're talking about an app that has amassed millions of users. One of the most popular apps that continues to grow that you probably haven't heard of, unless you've heard of Musical.ly. I'll give you a hint. Let's go. So in 2014, Musical.ly launched. Ah, that's a name you probably recognize, as did I. The app actually got relatively big, think Vine plus lip syncing. Now, across the Pacific Ocean, ByteDance went ahead and created a very similar app. In 2017, ByteDance acquired Musical.ly. The company decided that it would be more efficient and a better representation of what content is actually on the app by renaming it TikTok, which was already the name of the app over in China. And so here we are, millions of users and still growing. I believe sometime last year it was right around 17 or 18 million users and recently it was right at 80 or 90 and that's just for the US based one. So why are we talking about an app that is primarily dominated, 50% to be exact, by 13 to 24 year olds? I'll give you three reasons. One is potential, two is branding, and three is free help. I'll start off with the first one, and that's a pretty obvious one, is the potential of a new app. Anybody that has access to the internet, maybe a smartphone, and of course electricity, you can see the impact apps have every single day. Imagine if you were one of the first posters on Instagram. What about Facebook or MySpace? I still remember seeing Tom's face all over the place from MySpace. That might be dating myself. I think you get where I'm going with this. TikTok is early stages. I think the official rebrand was right in September of 2018. This app has a lot of potential, not just to provide a lot of entertainment and to impact those viewers with content, but it allows the people, the new creators, the people that just haven't been able to break through on a saturated Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, to actually get out, create, and build a fan base, a following. This is one of those opportunities that you'll look back and say, God, I wish I actually got on there and started doing that earlier. I think this app is really important for those of you that are trying to build a brand, such as myself. If you want to impact people, if you want to entertain people, whatever your background, your why is, what you're getting stoked about, what you're trying to do and build out your brand, this is a great place to get started. Which just leads me to the second one. If you haven't found an outlet to express yourself and build your brand yet, check out TikTok. Musical.ly was based around lip syncing. TikTok is not just singing songs and lip syncing. It has comedy, food, it has fitness. Pick some type of content and you can find it on TikTok. People create it every single day using music. If you already have a brand or you're starting to build one on YouTube or Instagram and you want to, most importantly, impact other people in a positive way, you want to entertain people, this is a great way to start building some of that fan base. It's a newer platform, so why not go in there, try to be one of the first movers, early adopters, and get going. You might be thinking, eh, this is just a fad, which is why I brushed it off the first time I heard it. My mistake. Since 2014, when it launched, it has continued to grow when it was rebranded and marketing started going out and you started getting people like Jimmy Fallon on board and Cardi B you realize that this app is going to continue to grow yes it's just short form video right now but there is so much potential to continue growing this I don't know about you but I'm gonna jump on that train number three was free help and you're like what are you talking about TikTok, the app wants to help their creators they actually have a creator program which is really cool a creator program that is something for the every day person the people that are just signing on if you're creating content if you spend a couple minutes on the app a day you have the ability to jump into some of these creator programs see the early stages help create and drive where TikTok is going to be after I had created a little bit of content I actually got accepted to the TikTok creator group even though I did get accepted into the TikTok food group even though I can't cook but it's not just about your skills it's about the content that you create and how creative you can get with it the creator group is essentially a place that TikTok can have a couple of strategic partners that help you create better content so you're probably like what's the big deal the big deal is that it's free help to improve your content you are pushing out to your following and basically your brand there are a lot of other places that give you a creator program or have some kind of education but it's reserved for the highest people the ones with the most followers the most fans the most subscribers if you're new to building a brand you might not have that yet so why wouldn't you have somebody help you create better content to impact and entertain what you're giving in return is some time and good content to help build the app. Let me know where you can find free help like that. 
Oh wait, I think this creator program and being allowed to be in the creator program is an excellent opportunity to not only grow as a person creating content, but also help build and drive how TikTok is going to continue to develop. Like I said, there's a lot of potential here. My thoughts on TikTok are extremely positive. I think there's great potential for people that are just now building a brand. I think there's a great way to actually continue to build a brand on something that's not saturated like Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn. And lastly, you have access to a creator group if you get in now. Why would you wait? If you haven't checked it out yet, go download TikTok, give it a shot, and go ahead and follow me on there as well, Josh CTV. If you like the video, go ahead and press like. If you want to see more content just like this, go ahead and press subscribe. Hope you guys have an excellent weekend. Adios.